Okay guys, welcome to tutorial number 49. Now all the decorators are an experimental feature in TypeScript and may change in future releases. I want to briefly talk about it because they are currently being used in Angular 2. So to enable experimental support for decorators, we need to save it as a compiler option. So over here in tsconfig.json, I'm going to add experimental decorators and set it to true. So now we can have decorators in our TypeScript file. And a decorator is nothing but a special kind of declaration that can be attached to classes, methods, or properties. And decorators get evaluated into a function that will be called at runtime. Now decorators begin with the at symbol. And over here, I have an example of a class decorator that you're going to find in Angular 2. So over here we have our class app component and to this we attach a decorator by just specifying it right above the class. And notice that there should not be a semicolon. Now this is a component and a component attaches some metadata to a class such as a selector and a template. Now what are these? A selector is nothing but a custom HTML tag. So just like how we can have a div tag, a paragraph tag, I can have a tag called my app in my HTML file. And whenever my app is encountered, it is going to be replaced by this template HTML. So that is the most basic functionality of this at component decorator. And for further information, I highly recommend you to watch my Angular 2 series. And for this video, that is going to be it. I just wanted to let you guys know of these, these decorators. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.